matter what type of music you listen to, whether it's rock, pop, classical, blues, electronic, or any of the other types of music out there, they all use the same building blocks. We call these tones and semitones. Tones are the bigger of the two building blocks. If you look at the size of the semitone block, you'll notice it's exactly half the size. This means if you stack two semitones together, they would equal one tone. Two semitones equals one tone. Using these different size building blocks, we can build towers. In music, we call these towers scales. A scale is a set of notes that musicians use when they are writing or performing music. There are thousands of different scales. To make a scale, stack your building blocks in any order you like. There is, however, one tower or scale that rules them all. A scale that is one of the most used throughout the world. We call this the major scale. Happy Birthday uses it. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star uses it. Someone Like You by Adele. Get Lucky by Daft Punk. They use it as well. In fact, the list is fairly endless. So how do we build this major scale with our building blocks? Well, we need to stack them in this order. Tone, tone, semitone. Tone, 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 semitone. Or TTS, T, TTS for short. You'll need to remember this as it's very important. So how do we take the TTS, T, TTS pattern and use it on an actual instrument? Well, first of all, we need to know what tones and semitones look like on an instrument. Tones and semitones are the distance between two notes. Let's take a look at the piano. Let's pick a note at random. This note is C. If we play the very next note above it, which in this case is the black note, we call this a semitone. The next closest note is called a semitone. Let's go back to our first note, but this time we're going to play the next white note. These two notes are separated by one note in the middle. If there is one note in between the two notes you have chosen, we call this a tone. Remember what we said earlier, two semitones equals one tone. Let's take a look at a guitar. It works in exactly the same way. Let's pick a random note. Now the very next fret is one semitone higher. If we skip a fret or play two semitones higher, these notes are a tone apart. So finally, how do you play a major scale on your instrument? Well, choose a note and then play through the TTS, T, TTS pattern. Tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. Grab an instrument and try it for yourself. Now you know about the basic building blocks of music, tones and semitones. You've also learned how to arrange these tones and semitones in the right order to play a major scale, one of the most common scales found in music. Now you've watched this video, click the link below to complete the quiz and test your knowledge.